Thank you. We've sold over 642 icon packs. This absolutely blows my mind. That's literally thousands of dollars being sent for the mission. Now, here's a step-by-step -step guide on exactly how to install it from the iPhone. A quick shout out to Rush Mills for inspiring me to make this video. Um, that's gonna help him and other people as well. All right, the first thing you wanna do is, as soon as you click on the download button, there are two options. So one is you can go in and see all the individual app icons if you just wanna pick a few. Um, you can also search for the icon that you're looking for. But the best way to do it is to download this zip file. So what we're gonna do, by the way, I'm using Safari. So let's click on the zip. And then on the top right corner, we've got this download button. So I'm gonna click on that. And then hit download. You've got this little button down here called downloads. And as you can see, the link is over here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just click on that and it should open your um, files app. Now here, can you see here? It says super dang black zip. So let's just click on that. And here you go. All your app icons are now loaded into, into there, okay? Now here's a short clip from the previous video that just goes through how to install the app onto your home screen. All right, now. What we gotta do is, first of all, you wanna open up the shortcut app. And let's create a new folder. So we add a new folder, super dang black home screen. Let's open that up. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna press this plus button and let's click on this open app. In this case, I wanna change the YouTube. I wanna make a YouTube icon. Um, once you've done that, it's a good idea to rename this because you're gonna have a lot It'll help you later down the track, trust me. Okay, and then the next thing you wanna do is you wanna press this button here, which is the share button. Then you wanna scroll down and tap on add to home screen. Okay, and this is a very important step. Make sure you remove the text because it just makes it cleaner, trust me. Okay, and then you wanna click tap on that and choose file. So I'll just type in YouTube, there we go, and that's it. Hit add. What's up? I've got my YouTube icon. So I'm going to uh, remove this from home screen. The way you keep this iOS home screen clean is by removing every single app off of the page other than the ones you want black. Okay, that's what I did. I got no apps on the screen. They're all in my app library, okay? Now I've got three apps on the screen, okay? You're gonna have, you might have 20 apps on the screen, right? And instead of moving them one by one like a like a noob stick. What you do is you drag one, right? You get your other finger and you go whoop, whoop, and then swipe to the page that you want to drop it. And wherever you drop it, it'll drop. I'll give you that one for free. I know I uploaded a video yesterday, but I'm literally recording this and uploading this today just to help one dude out. If you are new here and you're like, what the heck's going on? We run a tech channel, but with a bigger purpose. What we do every month is we save up money and once a year we fly out to third world countries and we support missionaries, charities and non-for-profits and we create content for them, documentaries, photos and things like that and we do this for free and this has become our life's mission and purpose for this family. All the support that you're giving us is actually helping people indirectly which is awesome and it feels amazing. See you guys in a future video.